Okay, we have here a quick integral. This one's from MIT 2022, number seven, I think it is. Yep, seven. So to get started with it, I know exactly two different ways, or they're really similar. We could just go probably straight away to integration by parts, I think, or we could do a U substitution first. And actually, I don't even know if integration by parts would work right away. So what I had in mind was the use of, just to clean that up, is I don't really know how to deal with sine x squared. So we'll do u equal to x squared, and then we'll do du equal to 2x dx. Now before we actually substitute it, let's get it, let's break up this x cubed in order to work with this. So I'm going to create this 2x that we have right there, and then so I'm not changing it, we'll also create half x squared so that what we have right here, we're gonna have u right there, and this is gonna be our du when we team up with dx. So rewriting it, let's take the one half up front as a constant, so we have one half, that thing becomes u, this thing becomes sine of u, and everything else is just du. So now we can do, on this, we can do integration by parts using the di method over here to the right, I want to differentiate this and integrate this. The reason is just because this is going to differentiate all the way down to zero. So we'll set it up, differentiate over here. That's just going to be one. Do it one more time and we get a zero. Then coming back over here, the thing I notice about it is that looks nothing like a U. That looks like a squiggly line. So let's do it, make that into a U, then integrate it. And what you get is minus cosine u, integrate again, you get minus sine of u. So then for a solution in u, it's going to be this stuff right here. We don't care about this last row because we have zero, zeroing it out. And that doesn't look like an arrow, but we'll make it better. So that's an arrow right there. So copying everything down, I think I'll go a little bit out of order because here we have minus times minus is plus, so it's going to become one half sine of u minus u cosine u, and that's everything. We just need to back substitute in order to finish it. So just plug in. I think what I'll do is we'll write it a little different, bring the two into the denominator here. So putting it together for my final solution, we have just sine x squared minus x squared cosine x squared all over two, add a plus c, and that's it. Okay, there you go, a quick and easy one from MIT 2022. Thanks everyone for watching. Please like and subscribe. Have a good day.